What's up guys, Leslie Robbins here for Young Hollywood. These kinds of shoots make me all sorts of giddy. I have crashed a rehearsal of the musical hair. It's going down at the Hollywood Bowl and I am one-on-one -on -one with the all-star cast. Rock of Ages, Hairspray, yeah. Step Up, which is my favorite franchise by the way. You got this, this is like in your sleep, right? Oh, it's so not in my sleep, you have no idea. Those are things where you get to say, I didn't like it, let's do it again. You know, the, on movies, there's, there, you know, Hairspray had five months of preparation. This has five days. So how do you organize such a small amount of rehearsal for the Hollywood Bowl? I have incredible people around me, my team, my associate director, and we just stare at each other and go like, okay, this is what we gotta do, this is what we gotta do, this is what we gotta do, and um, we're getting it done. Here, baby, there, mama, everyone, daddy, daddy, hey. Coveted gig. There's only a select few of you getting to be in hair at the Hollywood Bowl. Tell me how you got it. Um, you know, Adam Shankman is an old friend. I, when I say old, like a few years. Um, we worked on Glee together. He actually directed a few episodes. Um, it was lovely to work with him. He is a doll. I told Adam I would be thrilled to be a tree or a flower in the show, you know. It's one of those shows that I really, really love and I just love what it stands for and expressing yourself and being free and um, doing what you doing what you want. Take me back to your early days before you were Hunter, oh before the the star. Yes, well. Bring me some memories. Uh, I yeah, I did. I've actually done probably more theater than I've done uh, film and TV because I, I started I started acting when I was six, and from six to sixteen, I, I I was only able to do theater. I did theater uh, locally in Dallas, Texas. I, I miss those days because uh, I was a young kid and just kind of exploring the the theater world and the stage and playing pretend. Got a fond memory. Uh, I was doing Winnie the Pooh, and I played Christopher Robin, and I fell asleep during the show and they had to uh, poke me with a stick and wake me up. Like it stopped the show and I was like literally like, oh crap, we gotta do the rest of the play now. It's really great being here with these people. They're so amazing and Adam is just, I don't know how he's teaching us and I don't know how it's getting into our heads but somehow it is. So he's doing a good job. Yeah, he's incredible and you guys have about a week of rehearsal before you actually get on that stage. Yeah. I've never done anything like this in my life and it's very exhilarating. Of course I get sick, because that's just my luck. I'm like the 2%. If like, if there's like a problem, if like a doctor goes like, don't worry, there's only a 2% chance of this happening to you, it's like, oh yeah, that's me. Oh. Mario, I'm sorry, I'm sweating. It's like 100 degrees, we're in Hollywood. Rehearsed in hair. We're sweating for a good cause. We're in a chapel right now somewhere in Hollywood, and uh, it, it's been hot in here for three days, but you know, we're just getting ready for the bowl. We gotta put it all, in, you know, out there. This is an amazing, amazing opportunity. I grew up in Los Angeles. The Hollywood Bowl, I mean, I've been going my whole life. My brother's performed here a couple of times, and now I'm getting my shot. It's an enormous show, and to mount it in, we have, what, a week and a half is daunting, but I don't know, I feel like the L.A. crowd will be supportive, and Hair's the kind of show that you know, if you screw up, you can just say, I'm on drugs, and it'll be fine. There is nudity in it. Yeah, of course. For that. Yeah. Will we be seeing you naked? Uh, if not naked, really close. Yeah, of course. I try to work nudity into everything that I do. Me too. You know, just dinner parties. Uh -oh. Oh. You know, a night out on the town. You know. It's nice. Listed on my resume. How does that work for you? Not so great. <laughs> <laughs> you can never go back, and I am bringing my full self, fully clothed. <laughs> we shall see. You have to come and see. I'm gonna have. I'm gonna have my bottoms on though. Yeah. Could we talk about it? Was it up for discussion? I um, not really. Not nah, just, you know, because I still, I do the music side too, and it's, it's just a little different. You know, if this was my career career, I would probably do it. Hair goes back to Broadway. Yes. They say, Mario, come back. Come do the show. You got to go <laughs> full front. <laughs> you know what? I would do it for you. I'm going to be on a platform 
in my clothes. Good girl. Yeah. I haven't gotten a trainer this year, so I don't think it'd be a good idea. I will be among the nudity. Um, you know, it's going to be interesting because it's 2014 and people will have their Instagrams up and their Twitters and whatnot. Don't tweet our tweets. Just come see the show. Like, watch it like a grown-up human being and not through your phone. But come. <laughs> <laughs>